Hey y'all, Mike here from allamerican.org. And if you remember a little while back, I did a video on how to find fitness equipment made in the USA, specifically focusing on strength equipment. And now we are back today with part two, focusing on how to find cardio equipment made in the USA. So there's obviously a bunch of different equipment that you can get to get in a good cardio workout. So we're gonna be going over a bunch of different types of equipment within the cardio category. Now we do have some good related research on allamerican.org. So I'll put links to those articles in the description below, or you can just Google allamerican.org and whatever equipment that you're searching for, and we should have something for you on the site. We're gonna be going through our usual stuff in today's video on tips on material sourcing, as well as some great American-made brands and some to watch out for. Although I'm gonna switch up the format a little bit since we are covering a ton of different categories and just kind of go category by category and really talk about each one of those pieces within those different sections. As we go through all of our top picks, just keep in mind, it is actually really tough to find 100% made in the USA cardio equipment. These things are really bulky, oftentimes have a ton of electronics that are within each of the pieces of equipment and a lot of the big manufacturers and brands and even a lot of the smaller ones are sourcing some materials and parts from other countries so it's just really tough to find every single piece of like a treadmill or an elliptical or whatever else from american suppliers so there are several brands that I've included in this research that are just assembling in the USA and have some US sourced components, but do have some globally sourced components as well. But every single brand that I'm mentioning today are definitely assembling and manufacturing their stuff in the US. So let's kick off talking about treadmills. First up in treadmills, we have Tough Tread. These guys are based in Conroe, Texas, and are making a lot of great treadmills and exercise science equipment. They're a bit of a lesser known name in the industry, but are making some really high quality cardio equipment and treadmills, and they do source some components from other countries, like I mentioned before. Next up is Trueform Runner. These guys are based in Chester, Connecticut, and you wanna look for just their Trueform Runner model. All of their other models are made in South Korea, but their Trueform Runner, which is a manual treadmill, is manufactured in Connecticut with some domestic and globally sourced components. Landis, also another good option. They're based in Randolph, New Jersey, and has some great treadmills that are assembled there. And then Precore is another decent option. They are obviously a huge, well-known brand in the treadmill industry, specifically more so focused on commercial treadmills that you might find in a big gym, either one of the subscription ones or something in like an apartment building. They have a few models that are assembled here, specifically look for their 400, 600, and 800 series models, which are assembled in the US. They are 200 models and some of the other ones Ones are not. And then a couple other brands to call out in treadmills. Life Fitness has a few models that are made here, although they do have some manufacturing facilities in Hungary and Asia. And then Woodway is a decent option as well. Again, only some models made here, so make sure to check with their customer service team on whichever one that you're looking at. They also have some manufacturing facilities in Germany and Japan. I did want to call out Nordic Track as well. They're obviously a really well-known name in treadmills. Pretty much most of their stuff is manufactured manufactured overseas, but when we talked with their team, they do have a couple of incline treadmills that are assembled here. So look for their X22 incline treadmill and their X32i incline treadmill. Moving on to some treadmill brands to watch out for. Avoid brands like Assault Runner. Their manual treadmills are not made here. Echelon, also made in China. Also watch out for Horizon Treadmills. They're headquartered in Taiwan. And then there is a big parent company also in Taiwan called Diaco that has brands like Soul, Spirit, and Xterra that you'll see on Amazon and a bunch of other retailers. Pretty much all that stuff is manufactured in Taiwan, so make sure to avoid those guys. All right, let's move on to exercise bikes. Unfortunately, not too much to choose from here. I think the best option is Kaiser. They're based in Fresno, California and have a lot of different exercise bikes to choose from that are assembled in the US. Now there's a ton of other huge brands in the exercise bikes industry to watch out for. I mentioned Echelon earlier, they're made in China. Sunny Health is another one that is also imported. And then Peloton is obviously the big name 
in the industry. Now we have a full write-up on Peloton on allamerican.org and where they're manufacturing, but based on our research, we found that pretty much all their stuff is made in Taiwan. They bought Precore a couple of years back, which has some US manufacturing facilities, like I mentioned previously, that I think they had a little bit of a movement to try and bring back some manufacturing to the US, but they have not followed through on that verbal commitment at all. Pretty much all of their manufacturing happens in Taiwan for their exercise bikes that we've seen based on our research. All right, moving on, quickly touching on ellipticals. A couple of brands that I've already mentioned in this category that have ellipticals that are assembled in the USA is Kaiser, some good options there, as well as Landis, that company out of Randolph, New Jersey, that is also assembling some ellipticals here. And then you'll also see some brands in this category that I've mentioned previously to avoid folks like Horizon, Soul, Sunny Health have elliptical models, but like I mentioned earlier, all of that stuff is made overseas. All right, let's move on to rowers. A Couple of good options in this category, starting with Water Rower. Water Rower is based in Warren, Rhode Island, where they do all of their manufacturing for their base water rower models. And they even source all of the hardwoods for those rowers from the Appalachian mountain region of the US, which is awesome. Just make sure to watch out for their Nord equipment line, which is their exercise bike and a few other pieces of cardio equipment, which is made in Germany. And then Versa Rower is another good option here. They're made by a company called Versa Climber. They've been assembled in the US since 1981 and they're based in Santa Ana, California. A few brands to avoid in terms of rowers, Concept2 is probably the most popular brand in the rowers industry, and their basic rower model as well as their ski ergs are not made here, unfortunately. I've mentioned Echelon, Sunny Health, and Xterra as brands to avoid that are not manufacturing here, and then a couple more, Mr. Captain, popular rowers made in China, and then Hydro is another popular name. Unfortunately, they are made in Taiwan. And then rounding out our cardio equipment, talking about vertical climbers, Versa Climber is the best option in this category from what we could find in our research for American-made products. I mentioned them earlier, but they're based in Santana, California. They've been assembling in the US since 1981 and are generally a great option. So there's obviously a ton of different equipment that you can use to get in a great cardio workout. I only covered a few categories in today's video, so make sure to sound off in the comments below if I missed any of your favorite American-made cardio equipment brands. And if you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe. And as always, thanks for supporting your country and shopping American-made. See y'all next time.